Rendering a still image. Rendering is a is a process uh, of taking of creating a 2D image, a photorealistic image. It looks like we took a photo of it from a 3D scene. It shows the lighting, it shows the effects of the lighting, um, the shadows, the materials, the background, uh, all the other settings that are set. There's quite a few settings in these things. So to render a scene, we're going to go up to our main toolbar across the top. And we're going to come up here to um, our render setup. All right? We're going to go to render setup, click on it. And we're going to make sure that the render is the default scanline render. That's the first thing we're going to take a look at. Then the common tab is selected by default. Down here we're going to make sure that the time output is a single, uh, single frame. And then we're going to make sure that we're going to leave everything as default down here. And we're just going to go up and hit the render button. When I hit the render button, it creates the rendering in a in a output area and it'll come up with perspective frame zero uh, display gamma 2.2 etc uh, perspective means that this thing is a perspective view in the viewport that we used and frame zero refers to the number of the frames uh, that was rendered now if I want to save this to a file I come over here and hit the little floppy disk say save image It'll come up and ask me what folder path do I want it in, what folder do I want it in, and then what file name. And then it'll ask you uh, what save as type. I can hit the down arrow here and I can save it as any particular type I want. Uh, so I can save it as a JPEG, for example, or a PNG for a simple file that I want to put, say, in a report or something like that. So uh, I can do that. Uh, I'm just going to go up and I'm going to save it as a PNG. I'm going to save it here and I'm going to say two teapots render. All right, and I'm going to hit save and I'm going to hit OK. Now I can close these two dialog boxes and now I can go out to that particular use my Windows Explorer right I can go back out to that and find that and it's on my other screen you're not going to see that and I can open that up or use that in say Word or or some program like that it'll just be a simple raster image at that point so rendering a still image we can kick out a, a fast easy uh, rendering uh, by going up to our render setup and render setup will allow us to create a very fast rendering as well as a very high-end rendering as well